They are not reading your mind. They know what you want to do before you do it. What if I told you that everything in your home is quietly listening? You step out of the shower and suddenly your feed's flooded with skin care and shaving ads. Coincidence? Or something deeper? Ever felt like your thoughts were being echoed back to you through your phone? This isn't some wild conspiracy, it's real. It's called ambient intelligence. And it's already here. Your devices talk to each other. Your phone knows when you showered. Your smart mirror knows your skin condition. And your apps know your habits. Apps and websites track your clicks, scrolls, and even pauses. The data feeds into ad algorithms. Based on your past behavior, AI predicts what you might want next. It's not mind reading. It's pattern reading. Devices can sense your environment, location, time of day, activity, and tailor content accordingly. They are not reading your mind. They know what you want to do before you do it. The term ambient intelligence was coined in the late 90s by Eli Zelka and his team at Palo Alto Ventures, a vision of technology that would quietly adapt to our lives, making things smoother, smarter, and more intuitive. But somewhere along the way, that vision got hijacked. People talk about protecting their personal data from AI, but they don't realize. The moment you turn on your phone, boot up your PC, or open your smart fridge, the data stream begins. You're already feeding the system. Ambient intelligence was designed to serve us, to anticipate our needs, simplify our routines, and enhance our environments. But corporations got there first. Tech giants like Google, Amazon, Meta, Microsoft, and Apple pour billions into this technology. Not to make your life easier, but to make your behavior predictable, your choices profitable, and your attention monetizable. They shape the internet as we know it. Ambient intelligence and AI aren't the villains. They're just tools. The real power lies with those who wield them. And let's be honest, you can't win a game that's already rigged.